only when dissolved in soil water can plants take it up. The soil acts like a dynamic marketplace between geology and biology, but phosphorus can bond with minerals and become unavailable again. Soil chemistry, acidity or alkalinity, controls how much remains free. Fungi and bacteria liberate phosphorus from particles making it accessible to roots. When a plant draws phosphorus the element enters the active cycle. It becomes part of leaves, roots and seeds, the promise of the next generation. A field of wheat, a towering rainforest tree, a humble patch of grass, all built with soil phosphorus. Animals eat plants, carnivores eat herbivores, humans eat both. Phosphorus builds bones, teeth, and powers muscles, waste and decay return phosphorus to soil. Decomposers complete the local loop. Modern fertilizers boosted yields but altered the global cycle. Excess phosphorus washes away, streams, rivers, lakes, oceans, turning nutrient on land into pollutant in water. Blooms grow then die. Decomposition removes oxygen. Dead zones spread. Much sinks to the ocean floor becoming rock again over millions of years. We mine ancient rock to fertilize fields then lose it to the sea. A one-way street. Phosphate rock is finite. Keep nutrients on land and out of water with careful farming and watershed protection. We must manage this cycle with care.